hello students welcome to shore of sir classes so this question is about the matrix this is the matrix here and we have to choose whether it is positive definite or non negative definite but not positive definite or negative definite or the last option is neither negative definite nor positive definite so here are this following option and we have to solve this matrix to understand what would be the correct answer here so if we just solve this solve this in this way if we just solve this one this is suppose matrix a that is we have given a number a matrix that is this and then all the here if we just solve it and all the principal minus that a1 that is equal to 3 and 3 is greater than 0 now a2 a2 will be the matrix like 3 minus 1 minus 1 and 2 and here if we just solve it it would be 5 and this 5 would be greater than 0 now in case of if we just calculate the matrix a3 then the matrix will look like 3 minus 1 0 minus 1 2 minus 1 0 then minus 1 and 3 here so if we solve it it would be like 3 that is 6 minus 1 plus 1 minus 3 and equals to 12 and 12 is obviously greater than 0 let me adjust the page for you okay yeah now all the principal minus a that is greater than 0 so a matrix is positive definite matrix it is a positive so here the answer will be option a as it is positive definite so moving to the question this that is let if that is a real number square and the real number square that be given by f of x y and that is equals to x square plus x square y square plus sin x so this has been given here then the derivatives of f at x y is the linear transformating given by and there is these are the options so if we just solve this equation this is so simple i know this is looking like so tricky and tough but this is not let me just do this for you we can simply draw this matrix df that is equals to f1 x f1 y and here is f2 x f2 y or we can just write it like this way okay that is f1 x f1 y then f2 x 
and f to y now if we just solve it then we will get a matrix like this that is 2x 0 here cos x 2y it will look like this so ultimately the answer is this now let's see which one of the following option they are matching my answer that is 2x0 cos x 2y and this one is the answer that I'm looking for so the following answer will be option A thank you for watching this video